<laughs> Good evening and welcome to the last episode of Light Come a Roll of 2019. <laughs> I'm Justin Powell and you're watching D&D. <laughs> Joining me are these lovely players. I'm Allison and I'm playing the Jester Gideon. I'm Drew and I'm playing the Elf Monk Peleus. I'm Angela, I'm playing the Human Druid Fox. And I'm Mitch and I'm playing the Sorcerer Half Elf named Bran. To recap on last time. <laughs> uh, we killed Carl Weasel. We <laughs> oh, okay. We took his powers. <laughs> we have his powers now. Humanity is saved. That's canon, by the way. Oh. Canon. Carl Weasel canon. Has died. Well, <laughs> you likely have no idea what we're talking about right now. Yeah, I killed him. You join our Patreon. And you pay for our Patreon content, and you'll find you'll find <laughs> you'll out. Find you'll, you'll know. Yes. Um, but what actually happened is we're in the room in the sewer lower levels um gideon opened the coffin i did do that down there um, Bryn had found some information mm-hmm. on the dwarven race they uh, had built the sewer system and you had found some shackles that throw chains Peleus got a fire wrap um you successfully avoided death by drinking the right potion um anyway. yeah death <laughs> Hey, death. <laughs> and we're now um, coming back up. And we'd gone down to the last tunnel in the sewer when two gelatinous cubes had morphed out of the pipes mm-hmm. and surrounded you guys in this tunnel. Yeah. Nice. So currently, <coughs> the gelatinous cubes are each 120 feet away from you. And they're oh. slowly making their way towards you. Easy. Right. Hours of time. So, um, yeah, so there's two of them in a long tunnel, uh, each completely filling the tunnel as they've mm. kind of morphed into it and they've filled it. Mm. Um, yeah, they are green with sewage. And you, you can see inside of them Ugh. that there is small skeletons and actually some uh, like pieces and bits of armor and weaponry. As you look closer, we can you can actually see that it's like done. it's uh, sizzling in there <clears throat> and dissolving away very slowly. Sad. Oh. What? So that means they've killed some other people. That's not mm. very recently. Um, it's not joined yikes. Them. Yeah. <laughs> so, mm. but uh, <clears throat> from initiative last time, there was three eights, <laughs> a five, and a, th- and a three, three for the gelatinous cubes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, who among you would like to go first, eights? Well, I'll sh- I'll shoot first then. <laughs> shoot my shot. Yeah. Okay, Bren, and then. Uh. I feel like, mm-hmm. oh god, I don't know what I can do. <laughs> Alright. Alright, then folks. Then Gideon. And then the cubes. 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 <clears throat> Alright. A race against time as the cubes begin making their way towards you. Huh. It's time I shoot. A, All right, uh, yeah, Bryn, you were up first. I'll shoot a scorching ray at one of them. All right. Yeah. Um, roll to hit for each for each ray. So there's three of them. Mm-hmm. I guess I can send two at one. That is true. And then one at the other one. You can hold up both hands and shoot a different direction. Yeah, I'll shoot two at one, and I'll shoot one at the other one. Okay. Cool. So that is a plus a spell tech bonus. That's a 25. Yeah, that'll hit. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sweet. Can't be that hard to hit. Uh, then roll two, more, the so roll two more times. Because each you, you throw oh, out yeah. three scorching rays, and each one has to have a roll. <laughs> mm-hmm. I could just go. Uh, this one's a 10. 10 hits. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> and this one's also a 10. All right. Yeah, so <clears throat> there's one. So we'll say there's one to the right, and there's one to the left. Uh, which one would you like to hit? Uh, I'll hit the I'll hit the one with the right with two of them, and then hit with the left with one of them. Okay, so roll damage for the one on the right. Okay. Well, that's two d six per ray, correct? Yep. So that's forty six <laughs> for that one. Ooh, that's only two for that one. Okay. Oh, that's so, not good at all. So two for the first ray. Next ray. Uh, three. Um, five, eight. Eight for the next one. All right. So that was a total of ten damage to that one. Sweet. And the one on the left. Uh, two. 
Two damage total? Mm-hmm. All right. Let's hope that fire affects them at some somehow. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yes, as Please. you watch, as Bryn um, holds up both of his hands to either side of the tunnel. Very cool. Um, <laughs> and we'll say, yeah, we'll say you're facing north, like right and left-wise mm-hmm. here. Got it. So the one to the right is from where you came from, <clears throat> and the one to the left is where you're going. All right. Just for my reference. Cool. All right. So, yeah. So, um, you went to the right. Two flaming spheres come out of it into the one on the left one. Uh, the one on the right, the two flaming spheres hit the cube, and the cube kind of, um, as they hit it, the cube sizzles and burns, and kind of where it hits, like, gray, um, like, brown burned ooze is there. And it slowly, and you see the cube kind of shudder, like, no, oh, thank yeah. you. <laughs> um, but slowly, the kind of like starts, uh, like new ooze kind of like comes out and absorbs, and there's like the, the brown kind of synth part goes back in. It does take normal damage, so it takes the okay. 10 full points of damage. And the next one, it's kind of like a smaller little <laughs> uh, fire sphere, like hits it and goes <laughs> and deals two damage to it. All right. And the cube just kind of goes. <laughs> All right. Paleus. Cubes are 120 feet away. Yikes. Um, <coughs> hmm. Don't know if I want to get any closer. I'll just ready like a dart or something. Ready dart? Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. Uh, Fox, you're up. How far away are they? 120 feet. Mm, okay. Um, okay. Well... I darn it! I wish they were closer. Um, can I move up? Take that as my action. Uh, we have movement. Yeah, I'm so, gonna do that. So you have thirty. You can dash to be sixty if you'd like to. Yes, let's do that. Okay. Uh, which way are you dashing? Uh, towards the one that took more damage. Okay, so the one on the right. Right. Okay, so yeah, heading back down the way you came, <coughs> uh, you dash 60 feet, so you're now halfway to the gelatinous cube. Perfect. Uh, so you are here. All right. So yeah, you are now 60 feet away. Okay. That, that's uh, not good. All right. Uh, Gideon, it's your turn. I do have... <clears throat> okay. I'm going to take... I'm going to assume that, like, it's not going to do a whole lot of damage if I just use my weapons. So I'm going to cast Vicious Mockery on it. <laughs> because right. I, it, it has to... Um, I can do it twice a day, and they have to make a Wisdom saving throw, and I cannot imagine that they are that wise. <laughs> so, you know... <laughs> mm. Wise ooze. I, as a, I, as a news, is very... I'm very offended by that very, judgment. As in, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't, he takes didn't out know his glasses ooze. and puts in his ooze eyes. So they, like, yes. come out of the orb. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Um, I will say, you would know things to be mocked must have ears and a sense of sound. Well, sound that's is just vibration. Sense of being able to be mocked. Oh, man. A sense of shame. You're so... <laughs> I cannot use this because you have no shame. Oh, God, this. it doesn't work. Yeah. Okay. So you don't know about normal weapons or not yet. So. Okay, well, in that case, I could just try my short bow, short bow and do a distance. Yeah. You know. Yeah, I might just do that. All right. Okay, we're going to roll to attack that one. Um, 13. 13 hits. Ooh. <laughs> 1d6 plus 4. Roll for damage. Which one are you shooting? Uh, the closer, <clears throat> the closer one or... They're, they're each same. equal distance away. There's a right and a left. The right one is more damaged right now. I'll go for the right one. Okay. Um, 4 plus 4 is 8. 8 points of damage. All right. Nice. It's looking fine. As your arrow hits it, it kind of strikes into it. And it does hit the cube, and the cube kind of goes back, but the arrow kind of slowly gets absorbed. And you see the arrow dissolve into the cube. So it deals normal damage. Normal damage. Oh, normal damage. Yep. All right. Okay. Oh, cool. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, that brings us so you don't move. Nah. All right. Uh, <laughs> that brings us like, to the nah. cubes, and the cubes. Cube time. Um, are going to each uh, take their dash action and move uh, thirty feet. They can't move that far. Well, and they kind of go <laughs> um, <laughs> closer to you guys. 
So there's now six, 30 feet away from you, folks. Yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> and um, 90 feet away from you, uh, the rest of you. <clears throat> but they're okay. each uh, still equal distance away from the people in the middle, basically. Cool. All right. So, uh, but that's their turn. So, Bryn, you're up. Um, this is a good time to use it, I think. Uh, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna go <coughs> near the one that hasn't hasn't been as damaged. Okay. And I'm gonna try to use a fireball scroll on it. Okay. Oh, okay. Well. <coughs> So that's a 20 feet radius? Take that off. Yes. So that means anything in the 20 feet radius will be get hit. If it's just the cube, yeah. it'll so get Fox hit. So Fox is just out of range for it. Well, if you're going the Fox opposite direction. Fox is near the one oh, that's yeah. most damaged. Okay. So yeah, I can go next to the one that's not as damaged and try to use the fireball scroll. Yeah. You can. Um, so yeah, uh, you can move. So it's 30, 30 feet up, so you'll be 60 feet away. That's plenty of range for this uh, fireball scroll. Um, but yeah, uh, so you move, you see Bren uh, walk 30 feet in the opposite direction of Falks. So you know there. Uh, yeah, roll an Arcana check to try and use the Fireball Scroll. Um, that's a 16. 16. You successfully, uh, as you hold up the scroll and start reading off the Arcanic Ruins, um, the ruins gl uh, glow gold, <coughs> and then the scroll actually starts, the ruins start to burn and fire. And so then the scroll whoosh, um, goes away in a burst of flame. And out of that flame in a small circle goes a small bolt of fire whoosh, that grows bigger and bigger and bigger until it fills the entire cavern and eventually slams into the cube, whoosh, creating a ginormous explosion of that end of the tunnel. So, oh, that Good was job, cool. Good job, whoever. Wow. Uh, yeah, nice. roll all your damage. Yeah, so that's a 8d6. Yeah, roll 8d6. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> How do I what? Uh, so that's a four. All right. I can keep track, so you can control. Okay. One. Six. Nice. One. Okay. Four more. One. Oh, Jesus man. Jesus Christ. Come on, man. Two. Five. Okay, one more. Uh, four. All right. Mm, quick math. <laughs> quick math. Yeah. Quick math. Wow. Ten. So that's fourteen or no, twenty-four points of damage. Wow. What are you doing after that? Um, it's doing fine. Great. <laughs> as as the fireball disappears, about a fourth of the cube has been burned away. Um, and the cube, a little bit smaller now, and severely <laughs> singed all over it. Um, but yeah, the cube is still standing strong in the tunnel. Mm. So, all right. Yeah, Peleus. Hmm. I guess I'd dash up so I'm like 60 feet away so I can use a dart. <clears throat> um... Yeah, you can dash. So there's one to the right and to the left. The um, one to the left is now more damaged than the one to the right. Uh, let's go to the left then. All right. Yeah, um, going to the left. So you dash 60 <clears throat> feet? Yes, I'm 60 feet away. All right. If you dash 60 <coughs> feet, you're 30 feet away. So you can just walk 30 and then throw a dart. Sure, I'll do that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. So you're now 60 feet away. <clears throat> Twelve. Twelve hits. All right. Roll for damage. Six. Six. Okay. All right. Yeah. The dart. I mean, you throw it so hard, it like <clears throat> goes through the cube now. It's a little thinner, so it actually goes through the cube. There's like a little hole <laughs> <laughs> through the cube, and it's like. <laughs> Comes back together. Is it blocking the whole passageway now? It, uh, yeah, both cubes are blocking the entire passageway. 
even when it's a little smaller, just gets. You just kind of shortened it, basically. Oh. It's oh. still tall, you know. <laughs> you just burned away about a fourth of it. Mm-hmm. Got rid of one dimension. Thin wall of ooze now. <laughs> mm. um, all right. Uh, is that all, Peleus? Hmm. Punch it. <laughs> <laughs> Fire hand. So yeah. I don't know if I want to get... It's got skeletons in it. I don't want to be that close. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, got skeletons in it. I might stay. All right, Fox, you're up. Okay, you said it has metal in it? It does, yes. I'm going to use my heat metal. Ooh, okay, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I like that. Whoa. Okay, um, yeah. Choose a manufacturer. Blah, blah, blah. You cause the object to grow red hot. Any creature in physical contact takes 2d8 fire damage when you cast a spell. Yeah. It also says C page 250 at the bottom of the card. Oh. Um, we just going to... You can look it up in the player's handbook, but yeah, roll your 2d8 damage. Because that just happens, right? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you see, and this is the one closest to you, right? Mm-hmm. So yeah, the one 60 feet, um, 30 feet away from you now. Yes, because it moved. Um, they move. And you did see it can move 30 feet, so... Just so you know. Yeah. <laughs> um, just so you know. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, you see on the cube to the right, the little bits of metal and like part of a sword glow red hot inside of the cube, and steam starts coming from out of the cube. You see it starts to boil inside of it. Here we go. One. Okay. One. Seven. So eight. Eight. All right. Mm. Guys are. Not doing grand rolls. Can, can I, hey, can I hey, move? Or am I... You can move. That yeah, I'm was... gonna move back. <laughs> All right, you move back 30 feet. Yes, please. All right. Sounds good. <laughs> Thank you. All right, Gideon, it's your turn. Um, <clears throat> you know, it was stated earlier that a cool thing to do would be to light an arrow on fire and then shoot it at some at, and shoot it. Okay. Is that a thing you can do? Um, you have your torch. I have my torch with green fire. One of us like holds it for you. Roll an intelligence check for me. <laughs> mm, Actually, just... roll a wisdom check for me. Wisdom. Oh, just... Twelve. Twelve. Okay, your arrow is now on green fire. Sweet. <laughs> All right. Fire. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try <clears throat> shortbow shooting it at the thing just okay. for fun. Yeah. The very thin one, the damaged one. The damaged one? Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the one to the left. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, all right. Oh, my God. Eight. That hits. What? Oh, that's wow. A, yeah. I mean, it's a I, giant I cube can... filling the hallway. <laughs> so, <laughs> as your arrow goes dangerously close to the left side of the wall, almost hitting it before it hits mm-hmm. the cube. <laughs> as the fire is quite on, you try not to burn yourself as you pull your bow back. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you managed to hit the cube. Roll for damage. Uh, four plus four again. Eight. Eight. Um, and the green fire dealing one extra point of damage Woo! to it. So it's doing nine damage. Nine damage. I like that. Nice, I like that nice. a lot. Um, and the cube on the left, as you as your green uh, arrow, it kind of like, with the fire, kind of like sizzles through and goes through. The cube is now um, l- bloody. Oh, bloodied. So, bloodied. what can be uh, assumed as bloodied from ooze? <laughs> <Oozing. Yes. laughs> ooze blood. As like bits of ooze are now like draining out of it, <laughs> <laughs> and dripping onto the ground as it slowly inches forward. <laughs> gross. <laughs> Very All right. gross. Um, yeah, the cubes move thirty feet closer, Gosh, <laughs> closing in. Now sixty feet away from the middle of the ca- tavern, or. The tavern? <laughs> the tavern. The cavern. Like, sure. We were actually in the tavern. <laughs> We've been in the bar from the beginning yeah. this entire time. We've just been playing Hearthstone the whole time. <laughs> All right, yeah. Um, crazy people. All right, 60 feet away from the very middle of it. All right, uh, Bren, you're up. Um, I'll shoot a firebolt at the more damaged one. The okay, one. yeah, go for it. All right. Roll the hit. That's a uh, eight. Eight? Eight hits. Sweet. <laughs> Roll for damage. Um, <clears throat> yeah, um, that's a firebolt uh, D6, right? I believe it's a D10. Yeah, one D10. Okay, yeah. So roll for D10. Big number. <laughs> Big number, please. Yes, a 10. Nice. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Oh. Um, yeah. 
as your firebolt, um, wanting to be as powerful as a fireball, um, strikes the cube. It's not uh, as nice, guys. I don't have another firebolt scroll. Okay, just wait a little bit. You'll get there. Don't yeah. worry. Wait. <laughs> um, yeah, um, burns into the cube, going through the cube as well, creating a sizable hole going through. The, um, yeah, the cube shudders. <laughs> <laughs> now visibly cube angry. <laughs> cube angry. Yes. Um, mm. It's like a slime. All right, uh, Bren, you are I'm only 30 feet away from the cube now. Would you like to move back to the Yeah, side? I'll move back. All right, you move back. Paleus, you are 30 feet away from the cube. All right. Well, I don't want to punch it because it's absorbed the weapons. <laughs> so I'm just going to do another dart and then move back. Uh, yeah, throw another dart mm-hmm. for it. Oh, God. Well, 12. 12? <laughs> yeah, it hits. <laughs> it hit last time. <laughs> um. <laughs> Six. Six, all right. Six yeah, because plus five, yeah. Yep. <laughs> you crazy monkey. <laughs> monkey. <laughs> monkey. All right. Um, yeah, damage racking up. As your dart psh, uh, makes another hole in the cube. So. And then I move back. All right, you move back. <laughs> yeah. Good. Uh, only Falks is now the, out away from the center line. All right, uh, that brings us to Falks. Yeah, uh, I'm going to move back. But then for my bonus action, okay. I'm going to have the one I cast Heat Metal on take the same amount of damage. Okay, yeah. Yeah. So to roll 2d8. Or, right. yeah, 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 yeah. One. All right. Eight. Okay. <laughs> so eight total. Because I rolled seven. Okay. Yeah. I did the math before I said it out loud. Okay, sounds good. Eight total. Cool. Now I have to do math. Yuck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's right. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the metal continues to burn inside of the cube. More of it, like, kind of be like the inside of the cube becoming liquid and boiling uh, inside. Yeah, the cube shaking. <clears throat> All right. Uh, that was your bonus action. Yeah. All right. Do you have a main action? Like, I want to move back. That was your movement, so you still have a main action. Oh, well, uh, in that case. Um... Each cube 60 feet away from all of you. I don't... Mm. I don't really want to do anything else because like it's too far away for me to do produce flame. Uh, wait, hold on. You have totems, so you can still throw. Yeah, them. I have totems. Can I use entangle? Yeah, um, I can use entangle. That's one action. Yeah. Okay. Um, yes, I'm going to cast it at the one that's that I've been burning this whole time. Okay, yeah. Um, what does that have to do? Um, a creature in the area, when you cast a spell, succeed on a strength saving throw or be restrained. Okay. Uh, so he th- be restrained. Yeah, he yeah. can be restrained. So Great. Oh, he fails. <laughs> <laughs> Rolling a six. <laughs> hey, thank you. Uh, yeah, as the cube, uh, as you see, coming out of like all around in the tunnel, um, vines start coming out and like dirty liquid starts like kind of dripping off of them Ugh. as these like roots reach down <coughs> and go around the cube holding it in place kind of like claws around it and the cube kind of wiggling <laughs> uh, and it cannot move right yeah it uses a, uh, a creature restrained by the plants can use its action to make a strength check on, on the, so yes okay yeah, sounds good. Okay. So is that the one who's not as damaged can't move? Correct. That's the yes. One. Yeah. yeah. All right, uh, Gideon. Um. You know. Ooh, I do have um, a crossbow that I could use for fun. Okay. Please. <laughs> I like that. Odd. This is that, a time for fun. This is this a time, time for fun. fun. I've just been uh, sh- <laughs> shooting a lot. Oh well, that's um, nine. Nine hits. Oh, boy. Um, 1d8 plus 4. 7 plus 4 is 11. 11. All right. Yeah. Nice. Um, Yeah, as your crossbolt bolt um, strikes through it, kind of taking some of the ooze with it, uh, going through. (laughs) It is now on its last legs. Oh, yes. 
Um, that does bring us to the ooze now. Ooze As time. the one ooze, most damage um, comes 30 feet closer, now only 30 feet away from the group. The other one has to try and use his action to get out of here. Uh, succeeds. Roll again. <laughs> uh, all right. It's going to succeed again. He's rolling a lot to get good luck. <laughs> uh, what's your save? Uh, sorry? <laughs> uh, so what's... You look on your spell sheet. It should be on your spell sheet. It's here. Uh, 14. 14. It fails. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. 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 <laughs> All right. So, yeah, um, tries to wiggle through the vines, um, but, or roots, and it almost breaks through, but you see the roots kind of grow thicker and hold it in place. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> roots. Um, or, yeah, yeah, it's only, it's still 60 feet back. But I need some time. All right. Uh, yeah, that brings us to Bryn. Okay, I'm going to shoot a fireball at the weak one. Okay. That's a, that's going to be a 21, so that's going to hit. Yeah. <laughs> That'll hit. Mm, that doesn't hit. <laughs> Miss. Yeah, Try again. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's a nine. Nine points of damage. All right. It's got to be dead. Oh, getting, let him. getting so close. Oh, fireball so much help. Goes to the cube. Um, now, a sizable hole is now like in the cube, but just like barely some strands holding it together. Oh, man. Um, I got 24 points of health in one hit, and then it was like barely enough. It was like, yeah. it was hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Still going. It's that fine. That's correct. All right. Um, so, yeah. Um, Bryn, uh, so yeah, you guys are now a little bit offset because of how the cubes are coming in. So yeah, the cube to your left is 30 feet away. The cube to the right is 60 feet away. So, um, Bryn, you could move if you want to. I guess I can move back. Yeah, you can move back to be more in the middle. Mm-hmm. All right. Um, <coughs> yes, you are now 45 <laughs> feet away from each one. <laughs> right. <laughs> My this is math why we have so... general education, kids. Hey. <laughs> All right. Um, that brings us to Paleus. Okay. Um, do another dart. All right. Yeah. Go for it. <laughs> gonna I, don't, kill it. I don't have a ton of aerial stuff. Uh, she's gonna kill uh, it. Come on. He's so angry. He is gonna, oh my he's god. He's gonna get the kill count for this. Eleven. Gonna, you know yeah. <laughs> oh Come on, god. man. Seven. With the last dart. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, um, and you see Ooh. kind of this like intra, um, <laughs> integral Ooh. network of slime like holding this cube together. You aim right for the middle and all the bands break and it's almost like rubber bands stabbing. And the cube collapses in itself and spreads out on the floor um, and the bricks beneath it like sizzling. Gross. It was like <laughs> burned and uh, dissolved little bits of like pieces of like fall out of it and clang to the floor. Nasty. <laughs> yeah. <That's> nasty. <laughs> um, all right. So, yeah, one cube down. Good job, guys. Okay. Uh, Falks. Okay, this cube is 60 feet away from me? Yes. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to move 30 feet. I'm going to, for my action, I'm going to produce flame and throw it okay. <laughs> at the one that's restrained. Okay. So roll for that. Uh, yes. <laughs> this one. And you like to... Nat 20. Ooh, nat 20. All right. Now yeah, you hit. Yeah. If hit one, <laughs> one d8. This is not strong. Okay. All right. Seven. Seven. All right. You okay. Seven points of damage. And then for my bonus action, <laughs> gonna cast heat metal again to go renew for, it. Yeah. Uh, Woo! Metal inside of it. Yeah, Here we go. <laughs> bonus actions. Five. Okay. Nice. It's six. So eleven points of damage. Yep. Where to go? Yeah. As again, the cube now almost all of it inside is boiling liquid. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's on its last or it's bloody now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's bloody. Help. All right, uh, Gideon. Oh. <coughs> hmm. Should I go for the short bow or the crossbow on this one, everyone? <laughs> hmm. I'll go for. Yes, uh, up to, it's up to you. I think. Uh, I'll do a crossbow. It's 
I got a higher chance of getting more damage. All right. That's a, a 17 plus 5. Yeah, that'll hit. <laughs> <laughs> As an 8 has hit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 2 plus 4 is 6. Frick <laughs> hmm. nice. Max. Hmm. All right, yeah. Um, use the crossbow, right? Yeah. So your bolt oh. or, off it uh, pierces the cube, goes in a little bit. It was immediately dissolved in this boiling acid. Um, as a little hole, a little stream, tss, acid Ooh. comes out of it. It's now like leaking, boiling acid out of it. Cool. Cool. Um. <laughs> I gotta say, pretty aesthetically <laughs> interesting. Yeah. You know, it's passing the vibe check. Pass. All right. Uh, it's now the cube's turn. Uh, cube's turn. As the boiling acid that breaks out of it starts dissolving the roots around yeah. it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that Tristan. Nothing happened. At all. <laughs> uh, as it tries to get out, it fails as it rolls a two. <laughs> <laughs> um, so even with the now like kind of burned roots around it, this cube is just not having a good time. It's just trying to, to wiggle out of these roots. <laughs> um, all right, Bryn. All right. I'm going to shoot a magic missile at it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Magic My missile. Man. Yeah, as you clutch your green crystal, your eyes glow white, and you raise into the air. All right. So, yeah, roll for damage. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Four. Mm -mm. Nice. That's five plus one. Next one. Yeah. Uh, so that's three plus one, four. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then... Three plus one, four. Sweet. All right, dealing 11 points of damage. It is on its last legs. Oh, finally. Okay. okay. Yeah, three oh, white bolts kill it. go hey. into it. He's going to snipe my kill. <laughs> <laughs> and more boiling acid starts coming out. Now, like, four small holes, like, streams of acid coming out of them. Gross. All right. Paleus. All right. Sure, let's use these darts. Okay. Because <laughs> my melee's not going to... How many yeah. darts do you have, dog? <laughs> I have two more left. <laughs> Make them count. Miss, 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 miss. Miss. miss, miss, miss. <laughs> well, I mean, 17. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you physically can miss. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, 17. <laughs> it's the armor class for slime. <laughs> um, you can hit a root. It's six. <laughs> oh. Ah. oh, my so, God. So. Oh, six. God. <laughs> for damage. Oh, sick. Nice. Okay. Can't get above. Okay. <laughs> and that kills it. <laughs> uh, it's still alive. Just Gosh, barely. Yes. Yay! Right. More boy and acid come out of it. Um, mm. Gideon. Oh, maybe I'll get this one. Um, I'll oh, wait, no, sorry. No, Fox. Oh, oh, yeah. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. What? Like, oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Action. Gonna, gonna produce flame at it because right. I can't do anything else yeah, right now. All right. Here we go. Four. I'm gonna roll again. <laughs> well, you get. You get um, oh, yeah. Plus uh, your... Six. That hits. Yes. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. Just barely. Just, just barely <laughs> hits. Just barely. As, okay. like, it goes between two of the roots that are grabbing it. Just barely. barely. And hits it. Roll for damage. Seven. So with seven points of damage, um, there's this little, like, little lob. Just barely. <laughs> the cube explodes. <laughs> and boiled acid comes out and dissolves all the roots around it. <laughs> Um, and like goes into the trough into the middle of like sewage going down and like you see it like kind of just all of it get pushed back into the room from before. Cool. <laughs> all right. Cool. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Uh, both cubes are now gone. Yeah. Both cubes are now gone. Just like Cube World. Now gone. <laughs> now gone. <laughs> all right. Yeah. The passageway is clear. Yeah. Yeah. And nobody took any damage. Nobody Perfect. did. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> Good yeah. job, team. Good job. Good job, team. Took a couple Good spell slots. <coughs> it took, yeah. A lot of darts. <laughs> a lot of darts. All right. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, the tunnel ahead of you is clear. So. Let's, go Let's go down it. Yeah, you continue um, walking down it, and you come to the very large pipe uh, coming out of the wall. Um, actually, now that you get closer, it's actually larger than the one you like. your guys' boat came out of, and it's very <laughs> close to the floor. And you see, the cube that came out of it seemed to have pushed most of the sewage um, uh, out of the pipe, and there's just very a small little trickle coming out of it now. Well, that's pretty. Um, <laughs> as you come closer, you can hear. <laughs> it's very, very pristine. Yeah, very nice. Um, you can hear 
as you come closer, like machinery, yeah, machinery <laughs> sounds um, echoing through the pipe. And the pipe itself is like probably like seven feet in diameter. So cool. I hear machinery sounds out of this seven feet dynam diameter pipe. <laughs> exactly. <Wow. laughs> How do I know this? You read a book about dwarven. <laughs> yeah, I read it. <laughs> you guys should read. You, you would have I read that most. It's um, a real page turner. I must yeah, say. most <laughs> Rordian pipes are seven feet in diameter for the large ones. I know. I mean, I've learned a lot about sewage systems now. I mean, I didn't grow up with one. So. <laughs> That's right. You now have a trade to take back to your Bati village to install your own sewage system. There you system. go. Yeah, I know it's gonna be really complicated for <laughs> even though we don't have any houses, we just live in tents. But you have indoor plumbing. Yeah, we do have indoor plumbing. <laughs> yeah. Not like existent homes. Really complicated outhouses. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Here in Zati, we pride ourselves on our, on our plumbing system. Mr. G will have to come and visit. Yeah. So. We have nothing else but that. <laughs> Sewage. <laughs> Clean food and water? No. <laughs> Sewer Sewage? system? Oh, yes. yeah. Got it. Top Essentials notch. only. <laughs> Mm. All right. <laughs> we don't want to. We don't want to shit in the woods anymore. <laughs> you know, you gotta pick your battles, man. I know. All right. All right. I want to see Zati so, so, so bad. <laughs> I know it's going oh. to be a great little section because we go to Zati, then we're going to go to Goomba Town. Goomba right? <laughs> Town, guys! <laughs> oh, all right. Um, would you like to enter the pipe? Yeah! yeah. Okay. You all go into the pipe, um, your feet clanging a little loudly on this metal pipe. I'm, I'm jumping. Not good. I'm like... Gideon jumps, making large clang, 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 clang. Gideon, shut up! Vibrating, echoing, echoing down deep into the pipe. As you look ahead, it turns off to the right. Oh, wait, mm. turns off to the right? Oh, yep. Okay, so we're going north again. Yes? Yep, yes. tis true. <laughs> true tis true, young adventurer. Tis true. Okay, so. It All right, yeah, true. heading um, into the pipe, you turn right, and up ahead you walk about 30 feet, and... The pipe seems to slope downwards uh, <laughs> deeper into the earth, almost making a really gross slide. Oh, cool. Um, so you can try, gross. you can slide down on your rear ends if you'd like. It's mm. pretty gross. Or you can try and uh, very nice, dexterously slide down on your feet. I would like that option. And I would like <laughs> to attempt that one. Yeah. Mm. So that, that's dexterity. All right. So yeah. Or, so, um, or if you want to go at all, it's up to you. I would like to go down the it's pipe. It's looking down the pipe. It goes about 50 feet down, and then at the bottom you can see it kind of levels out, and you can see light coming from that part of the pipe down there. Nice. Well, you can always try, Gideon. I mean, I'm and not And the machinery stop you. sounds get louder and coming from that direction. I'm going to go down the pipe. Yeah. Is this a mm -hmm. dexterity check? Yeah, make an acrobatics check. Acrobatics. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. 8 plus 6 is uh, 14. Uh, yeah, you very gracefully do a little leap and land with both feet kind of like going Woo. sideways down the pipe. And you see Gideon just whoo. Woo! <laughs> Surfing USA. Down the pipe. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I'm down, all right, I'm down the pipe. All right, all right. Gideon leaves. Uh, what are the rest of you doing? I'm going to also go down Same. the pipe. All right. Just leave me, you leave. <laughs> <laughs> we, can go, we can go, guys. Bye. <laughs> um, you hear on the back of Gideon, Whee! Whee! Oh, it's like in it's a, a talking the sword. Of <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's like, a good time. <laughs> yeah, it's like in the Chamber of Secrets. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. You also oh, hear, yeah. "Who are you guys?" Hey, what? Hey, what? Oh hey, wait, uh, yeah, he has short-term memory. Oh. Every day it resets. Hey, uh, hey, uh, uh, we're we're your buds. <laughs> we're going on an adventure right now. All right, you say this as you're like sliding down. Yeah. He's like, "Okay." <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Wow. All right. Um, so yeah, acrobatics checks from those who yes. like to dexterously slide down the pipe. Twenty-four. Jesus. Eleven. <laughs> Twelve. Yeah, Peleus just like steps forward. And, like he's like smoothly like standing as his like, feet like, slide down. down. He's like, oh. Even it's also enhanced by his water walking ring as you're like. Oh yeah! Out oh my water. gosh! He almost just like home and just like slide down perfectly <laughs> going down. Uh, what would you guys get? Uh, 12. 11. 12, 11. All right. Um, Bren, uh, you watch Paleos go down. You're like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, as you, you just kind of like, you try to step as Paleos does. Um, and you, you, you almost slip, um, but you find your footing and you kind of like wobbly. 
uh, make it down the pipe behind Pele. <laughs> this <laughs> godlike figure. <laughs> you okay back there? You all right? <laughs> Are you okay? All right, you bitch. Uh, <laughs> uh, Fox. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, you see Bryn go down and... Fall into... <laughs> <laughs> you as well take a nasty first step going down. Uh, roll a dex 30 saving throw oh, for me. Oh, great. Fall in the sewer. Fall in the sewer. <laughs> Fall in the sewer. 13? 13. All right, as you you do find your footing, just uh, barely, as you kind of like, you take a step forward and you like, ha- your whole body goes forward, like it's on one foot, and you barely, as your face gets very dangerously close to the floor, but then you find your way back and you're <laughs> And uh, you, you do make kind of a large clang as your foot, <laughs> so people turn around like, hmm. <laughs> um, I'm having a hard yeah, day, guys. None of, all of you, uh, Get down the sewer without falling into it. Cool. Yay! Good work, everyone. Good. Good right. work. Good job, team. Uh, Gideon, you're the first one at the bottom. Mm-hmm. You can see the pipe comes out, and you can see um, outside is a very large room filled with machinery, and there's uh, one piece of machinery right now with like large pistons going in front of you, are kind of like blocking your view of the rest of it. But um, with it like going into the wall to the left and off to the right, um, it's kind of like a little open. Is an open area, I believe. Cool. So. All right. The rest of you get there and see this as well. Mm-hmm. Well, welcome <laughs> to Hello. the machine room. All right. <laughs> um, so yeah, you're now in the machine room. Yeah. All right. Hooray. Cool. Okay. Um, why don't you all make a perception check for me? Ah, uh, seven. Not twenty. <laughs> Ooh, oh. Eleven. Fifteen. Okay, well, <laughs> natural 20 here. <laughs> um, why don't you make a little star next to perception mm-hmm. for yourself? Okay. Um, so, uh, listen. You see, as. Let me have this. Looking, as there's kind of like little like cracks in the machinery that, as it's not completely solid with a lot of pipes and things going in and out of it. Um, and like also like liquid starts like leaking out in some places and the steam's going. Off it in some other places. Um, again, you can actually see the room going further um, seems to have another lowered section into it. Mm. But it's a massive room you're in, as you can barely see the other side, um, also filled with machinery. Okay. As you look up, you can see um, tons of pipes coming out of the ceiling and going um, like literally almost like a hundred pipes coming out of the ceiling in different places, each of varying size coming down and then going uh, inward towards the room at a mm-hmm. slant. And as you look up, you can actually see they're all coming together to like one place, probably the central area of the room. Okay. But as you look up, you can see a few claws here and there kind of come up out of the pipe um, just as you look up. Ah, um, hey guys, we're not alone. Looking like kobold um, yeah. claws from before. It's probably a kobold in here. Oh, not mm-hmm. another one. Um, but you probably saw 12 um, different areas where cobalt claws were. Oh, <laughs> so we are very much not alone. Okay. Um, but you also hear um, the sound of um, heavy breathing and also some small chattering of very familiar humanoid, uh, uh, familiar humanoid esque type voice. Okay. Uh, okay. Further into the center of the room. Okay. So I'm going to go towards the, the center of the room. All right, yeah. Um, moving to the right to get around this very large machinery, you can see that this room um, is a massive kind of collection area mm-hmm. for the sewer. And you also, you also hear there's a very massive amount of running water, uh, running sewage exiting this room. And so looking at it from the north, so you, you entered kind of like the southern part of the room, mm-hmm. we'll say. So as you come around the machinery to the right, there is um, stairs going down, kind of into like a lowered area okay. of the room, and the stairs go over kind of this like sewage trough, um, heading around and going out of the west side of the room. There's actually a lot of light coming in and a very large hole, and sewage is just pouring out of it. That's probably outside, maybe. Uh, as it seems like daylight is streaming in. Hmm. Um, but in the middle of the room, <laughs> there is a gigantic um, cylinder going up, and what looks like almost like a very large, um, you know, like those 
uh, like railroad cars that you like pump on either side. Oh yeah, yeah. It's like one of those lovers, but it's humongous, and working it is about sixty humans, um, all in rags and blindfolded, pumping up and down in the middle of this room. Ah, okay. Ah, so okay, cool. So I'm gonna like beckon you guys over. <laughs> Come look at this. I'm like, wow, look at no, just, <laughs> look at all those people. Look at all those people. I don't, I don't see that. <laughs> mm, okay. So, out there is probably daylight and an exit. Mm-hmm. If we can get these people out of here, that would be nice. But mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. And how is this place going to have running sewage? <laughs> running sewage system. <laughs> Yeah, so there's mm. yeah humans pumping the, the sewer system here. The other side of the room is kind of an exact copy of where you just came from. On the other side, there's stairs going up from that lowered area, going up to in the area mm. with a bunch of machinery and stuff oh, like okay. that. That makes sense. Mm-hmm. All right, and yeah, and all the pipes coming in from the ceiling are like going into this one central pipe that goes down kind of below. And then like all along the walls of this lower area are pipes um, coming out with sewage, like pouring out of them, going into the trough, going out to the open air, leading out. Cool. So yeah. So what do you guys do? Well, are there like are there guards? guards yeah. Um, with your natural twenty, you don't see, except for the things you saw on the ceiling. There is no one else around. Okay. Hmm. Okay. I think it'd be fun to cause a ruckus. Uh, let's think about this ruckus first. We could say, well, we could walk what are y'all doing? The well, they're, they're, all, they're, not... they're all blindfolded, so let's carefully We could them. say, we could pretend to be guards and shepherd them to the exit and then set them free. That, we could, we do, could do that. that. Yeah. that don't, yeah. nah, that'd be something. That, we could do that. That'd be something. All right. Let's I feel sure really uneasy, it. but okay, let's try this. <laughs> let's try oh, sure. God. I just threw my pencil on the ground. Gideon. Something's got to fall on the ground at least once. <laughs> <laughs> got to keep with tradition. So. Got to keep right. tradition. the traditions. So we can pretend we're guards, and we're going to be like, we're taking our routine outside tour. Yeah. We're going outside for a routine. I mean, mm. for, a, for, a, for a surprise work test. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise work test outside. We <laughs> don't have enough room in here. So, right, so uh, we yeah. need to move you guys. So who's who's doing what here? <laughs> um, I have a good charisma. Wait, should we check and I see what's not. outside first? So we oh, don't yeah, just like send them off true. a cliff. <laughs> 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 yeah, <laughs> and which one of you is Jimmy G's Jimmy Gorgonzola's Gor- Gorgonzola's <laughs> Gor- 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 girl. Oh. Okay. Which one of you is Goth Chicks? <laughs> goth Chicks girl. Yeah, goth Chicks son. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, are there any babies in here? Um Yeah, looking at the crowd, there it is a mix of men, women, and children. Oh. Baby. How is a baby pushing the thing? Are they all you humans? You said kids, not babies. Are they all humans? Um, yeah, they are all humans, okay. you can see. Yeah. I'm going to go check and see what's outside. <laughs> Don't <laughs> right. lemming them off so, the cliff. So yeah, you go down into the lowered area, and going around to the left uh, to kind of look out, as you get closer, you can see there is, there is on, kind of on like, so there's a, an edge to kind of where the trough comes up on the left side, and then heads out, kind of like two streams conjoining <clears> to go out. Um, and as you look outside, um, there's a giant hole, and it's like basically the wall here. And you can actually see it's very odd, but looking out the hole and up, there seems to be a gigantic structure um, leading away from the hole, going off into the distance. Um, looking down the hole, the stream seems to immediately fall off and go down into a stark, like deep ravine. <laughs> but going out, you can hear extreme running water, like. An enormous amount of running water thousands of feet below. Uh, but on the very right side of the hole, there is a very small ledge that leads out. Um, well, should we still do it after I describe this area? 
It's hmm. Seems a little risky. Risky. Yeah. Well, it's the only way to get him out. Yeah. We should ask them. <laughs> yeah, that works. <laughs> right, so we're the new prison guard. And, uh, um, we take your we take your opinion into consideration. Um, so, yeah, so I mean, <laughs> there's all of them, or there's two of them, the two you came to rescue. So. Well, we can just get them, all and then like now we know where they are and where the exit is, and so we can just. Go back in. When you want to slurp <laughs> them up, get them out. When you want to slurp up all the other humans. Yeah, get them out. Get them out. You know, that take a lot of time. Get them out. They're all blindfolded, so we can at least take their blindfolds off. Mm -hmm. Hypothetically, it's not like they're incapable to walk. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm down. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, I mean, yes. Hmm. It's taking so much time. <laughs> I'm. I'm. Let's just get them all out now. Let's yeah. just. Yeah. Let's just let's just go around ripping off blindfolds and being like, "All right, everyone, well, you're good." All right, let's you're gonna, ride gently gonna now. Are any of you Goomba's <laughs> relative? <laughs> all right, so, so who is doing what? And tell me. I will. Uh, I will. Can I just fastly be ripping off? I'll blindfolds? take. I'll take right. off blindfolds. So you go to yeah. take off blindfolds. Yeah. You guys, are you we're... are you saying things, Bren, or what are you doing? <laughs> uh, I can. I can't message all of them at once. You can speak it loud. You could, you could, you could just. Yeah, okay, I'll, I'll, tell them that we're still, I'll tell them still that we're we're guard, we're guards or something. We're taking off their blindfolds. So oh, yeah. You just tell them whenever you want. We'll make it work. Yeah, do okay. a bit. A do a bit. Humans. Do some stand up. So, all of you go down. Um, you approach the humans. Uh, Bryn, what do you say? Hello, humans. <laughs> People the echo of the reverberates under. throughout the room. <laughs> People of the underworld. <laughs> <laughs> my name is my, my name's Bren. <laughs> I got my friends here, and uh, we're gonna take you outside for a bit. Have any have, have any of you been outside before? <laughs> any of you? Tough um, crowd. <laughs> the humans you see as like a large creaking sound comes as like they all stop um, pumping, and they all just kind of like start looking at each other like, what? What is happening? Um, I'm up here. You, I'm up here. <laughs> got blindfolds. Um, you guys go down, and as soon as you start um, touching the shoulders of some of them, you hear a small squeaky voice coming from the top of the ceiling. Oh boy! So <laughs> you think you can come down here? I and wasn't free, our workers. I, I wasn't ready for that one. <laughs> to be real. Um, I was not prepared. Um, sir, uh, that's exactly what we were thinking that's about. Exactly. Right. Hey, yeah. hey, you are correct. Yeah. Yes. yeah you, Good you guys. Did. Yeah. As you look up, um, you can't quite make out where the voice is coming from, as it's coming from somewhere up in the network of pipes. <laughs> These humans may never leave. <laughs> They're going to be gone and never return. Who are you? Who are we speaking to right now, dude? I am the one who speaks for us all. The king. The king of rats? No, that horrid fool. Well, filthy, filthy man. Well, okay. Think about this. Think about this, sir. Um, we just did you a favor. We killed the rat king. We killed the rat king, and uh, I think we, you know, expect something in return. How about or 60 else. people? <laughs> we um, had him under control. Uh -huh. Are you sure about that? Wait, I have an idea. We are sure about that. I have an are idea. you sure about I, that? I, I don't huddle, have any proof. We huddle, I have an idea. I have enough Rat King blood to, to turn into him one time. <laughs> what is that going to do? We just D said we killed him. I distract him and then say, I am the Rat King. I'm back. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Come out and fight me, All King. Right. All right. <laughs> so wanna, you could try that. Um, why not? <laughs> I want to try. Um, okay. Let's just um, enable him. That's right. I'm, I'm gonna. That's... I don't know when else I would use the Rat but, King, except in this instance. <laughs> you, this was specifically for this situation. But, but sir, this is so so. But sir, uh, that, well, that's going on. But sir, we can we, we could deal this. You know, I'm. I don't think you had the Rat King under control, dude. That was my uh, my personal opinion. Um, <laughs> Your personal opinion means nothing to us. I mean, okay. how could Did you, you like nothing to us? Nothing to us. Nothing to us. As like. A lot of other voices start joining in. I mean, oh, it's a sound, choir. You sound, like, you sound like you guys are the, what are they called? The the, the, the uh, choral guys? Um, the what? The what? The, the, the lizard dudes. The kobolds? Oh, the kobolds. Yeah, yeah, kobolds. Yeah. You kobolds. sound like you're the kobolds. Um, we met some of the kobolds in the sewers, so I'm, uh, I'm, we were pretty friendly with you. Um, so uh, 
I, I just don't see why you need these humans here. I feel like you guys have enough to run the sewers on your own, I must say. So, uh... The humans power the sewers! And we get paid! Well, you could get paid to run the sewers yourselves. Yeah. But that would be a lot of work. And they work for us! <laughs> Yeah, but like, you Free know. slave labor. Yeah, that's not cool, man. Yeah, yeah. but we live in a capitalistic society. Now. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, sir, um, I feel like if this labor. comes to light, you know, if I. And like, in a capitalist rock... society, the one with the most money wins. <laughs> I mean, we are under Vinio and they don't like humans, so. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, I know, but they don't know this. <coughs> Even the person who runs the sewer doesn't know that, that the humans are running. So, so sirs, um. Co- cobalts, yeah, um. <laughs> I like. Yep. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh, you know, um, I think that saving, you know, leaving the human, like, what do you even have against the humans? I mean, I guess the free labor, and that's a pretty good deal and all. But <laughs> what they ever do to you? He speaks about, truth. Finally, he's smart. Let, okay, let's think about it this way: they get work very done very slowly, but you guys get it done really fast because you're much stronger than humans. Mm. But then we would have to walk, and there'd be no time to bathe in our largest bias of gold. Yeah, but think about it this way, guys. See, if you just lay around all day, you're just gonna be, your life is just gonna be unfulfilled. Like, if you actually do We have things, gold, sir. <laughs> we are fulfilled enough. Yeah, but what are you going to do with the gold? You can have can we buy these people out yeah, here? Yeah, but what are you going to do with the gold? You can't pay anything with it. You live in the sewers. What is the currency system down here? <laughs> What's like, your economy? You're not buy yeah. anything. Is we... there an economy in the sewer system that I missed? We pay a middleman to go run and get us things. We are well looked after. What? What? That's some lore I don't have time for. Okay, so <laughs> if we give you money, can we free these people? How much money? Um, I've got. Are, you, are we guys gonna pull this together? Or am I just gonna have I mean, to? She, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna give got... up my 400 gold. Oh, you have yeah. I have 150 gold, three platinum, and I'm willing to give you this gem. I'm not gonna. Uh, what? No, no way. I, this. Okay, I'm gonna turn into the Rat King. <laughs> <laughs> we have three very different strategies. <laughs> All right, both of you roll persuasion. You I turn into the king. <laughs> roll deception. Phileas <laughs> is here. <laughs> oh, no. I can't okay. do much. <laughs> um, I, uh, persuasion. I'm not good at talking I'm going to roll that one again. <laughs> I, got, roll I got a 15. 15? Okay. Where's the okay. persuasion? Oh, it's right here. Okay. Well, here we go. Six on persuasion. <laughs> If anything else, I am just uh, the random. Oh, my gosh. That's, Ten. <laughs> that is that a... Didn't help. That is a 19. A 19. All right. The Rat King? <laughs> you lied. He said he was dead. I am not dead. <laughs> I've come to settle my score. <laughs> Come down and fight well, in a room that is not this one. <laughs> <laughs> the wet king wishes to die. Hmm. Well, <laughs> try and get to me. I start running. Oh no! I'm just scampering around. Oh my gosh! I guess to another room. Meet at Peleus' house and we don't meet at Brynn, okay, you do that. <laughs> Brynn, what do you say? I'm the Rat King. Well, you are the Rat King. I mean, obviously we did not kill the Rat King because the Rat King's right there. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. I thought he was but dead. You might, you, you know, you might have to be pretty angry at rat, the Rat King because he calls himself the King. So think about it this way. You can't be the King of the Sewers if somebody else is calling themselves King. Tis so, true, I am King Ho, King of the Sewers. Well, you're not really the King because there's another king yeah. in the sewers, so like you got to for the title of king right <laughs> now, brothers. <laughs> we must kill the rat king and his followers. Uh, no, well I'm not I'm a not, follower. I'm not affiliated with yeah, them. I'm, I'm personally not <laughs> a Indeed, follower. Indeed, combat of the rat formation king. A. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know these guys. Yeah, you hear I'm a large clang personally... come from the top of the ceiling <laughs> as two of the pipes fall and crash into the floor on either side of you. And a very large mechanical structure falls <laughs> um, no. under the ground. Huh? Yeah, I'm personally not a fan of the Rat King. I am not. No, a fan. no, no. I'm not a fan of his fa- a fascist agenda. No, it's so. awful. Yeah, I have, I have a, a very fascist agenda. And I don't, <laughs> don't these guys at all. 
So uh, don't pay, yeah. pay any attention and to them. Only the mechanical yeah, we tried structure to kill that them. falls it looks like a, a gigantic furnace with like <laughs> a stovepipe on the back, <laughs> and then on the front looks like like the like the opening to like a smithing forge basically. Cool. And all along the side of it are little petals and like four rows of it, <laughs> and it's about like 15 feet tall. And out of the ceiling, ropes come down and like. Almost a hundred kobolds come out of the ceiling. Hey, um... <laughs> run, bitch, run! I, so I begin scampering away. Okay. Um, and the kobolds uh, come onto the machine, and they almost... And they start forming this giant mass on it. And there's, like... You see kobolds start pedaling, and as these two, like, legs come out from it... Oh my gosh. And there's now, like... Basically, like, a shell of kobolds around the machine... And two legs come out, and it almost looks like um, a dragon form has been formed by these kobolds coming out of the machine. That's what? really cool. But <laughs> <laughs> everyone roll initiative. No, no. no. <laughs> I'm not a follower of the Rat King. I do. Not I do not agree with this. The agenda. Rat King got a um, 11, 13, uh, dirty 20, 17. Okay. So 20, 17. Uh, Great. <laughs> <laughs> so how dead are we? Um, sirs, <laughs> I am not affiliated with the Rat King, as I said earlier. <laughs> so uh, you do not have to attack me with his political agenda. I I understand the misconception. But um, the I mean, we tried kobold, to kill him. The last kobold to come down, you see, has a yeah. crown of gold and like a golden scepter. Oh. It says, Oh, right! We'll attack the Rat King first! We'll deal with you later! As he, like, falls onto it, and, like, as he last says, like, deal with you later, it goes into, like, a megaphone, like, coming out of the oh my gosh. thing, basically. Um, um, good right. judgment, sirs. Um, <laughs> I, will, I will let you do that. Yeah, um, we'll be right here. I'll just be right, right here we'll over be right here, here by this big crowd over here. Um, so, yeah. Okay. So, um, okay. so you're next to the stairs right now. Basically. Yeah, I'm just gonna bolt. I'm going. Okay, so... I'm bouncing. So, um, so mm -hmm. dirty 20, right, for falls. Yeah. Um, uh, okay. 20 to 15. Who had that? So oh, uh, 17. 17? I had a 13. Okay, what'd you get? An 11. <laughs> <laughs> True. <laughs> oh, the rat king. <laughs> Long live the rat king. Long live the rat king. He was a good king. Not for very he much was, longer. He was a good king, but <laughs> mm, his people loved him, and you know, that, in the end, that's his all that rat matters. people. His rat people adored him. I wrote you down as rat king in the order. Thank God, <laughs> and as you should. Commit to your role. All right, um, I am the Fox, rat king. you were the first to go as this kind of wormy mass with the machine mm -hmm. in the middle turns towards the rat king. And you hear the pedals start whirling, and like a gigantic roar begins. And um, how close am I to the Rat King? Um, to the Rat King. To the Rat King. Let's see. I need to. Are you gonna kill me? Are you gonna kill me? Am I gonna die? No, 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 no. That's not the plan. <laughs> I need to like. Okay. Because you're planning to run, right? Yeah. I was gonna give you a bear totem and I'll give you some health points. Oh. So you can just book it. Woo! I like that. <laughs> when this lasts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> That's basically what the bear totem yeah. does. Okay. All right, so we'll see the three of you over here. He's here. And so basically, so this machine has fallen um, kind of in like the middle of all you. You three are on one side um, while. The Rat King is completely alone towards the stairs. Mm -hmm. You guys are more towards like the human s squad. Yeah. So. Okay. All right. Uh, yeah, the humans are completely freaking out and yeah. uh, try to move away, but you can see they're all shackled in place on on the um, pump, basically. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, shackled to like their ankle. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. So first, yeah, folks, it is your turn. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Can I like throw the bear spirit of totem at her? <laughs> like, yeah, it is range. Catch. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no, it, well, it lands on the ground basically. Yeah. Okay. So that's that's a bonus action. Um, All right. Yeah, and we'll say she's about thirty feet away from you, so that works fine. Um, yeah. So. Okay. So she gets. 
Nine temporary hit points. That's a lot of them. So yeah, so rather than your temporary hit points slot, you'll need all of them. Yes, you will. Um, oh, that's, thank you for yeah. sharing. And then for my action, I'm gonna, I don't want to anger this dragon. <laughs> uh, um, 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 I'm gonna go over to the humans and try and like calm them down. That's what's going to happen there. Okay, um, make a persuasion roll. 15. 15. Oh, wait, what do you say? Hmm? Oh, um, don't worry. We've got this situation under control. We'll get you out of here. Um, about like <clears throat> three-fourths of the crowd kind of start calming down. Or okay. like get as far away as possible from right. this thing. Get away from the noises. Um, as Most of them are still blindfolded. It's like, what's going on? What's happening? What's going on? Like, you okay. You okay. Okay. As they do hear a human voice not talking to them. Um, all right. That brings us to Peleus. <laughs> yeah. You're all about like 10 feet away yeah. from this gigantic thing that's not attacking you currently, it's attacking the Rat King. So. Oh, <laughs> oh, is everybody like within 30 feet of me? Or... Um, you threw it towards yeah. Hawks, right? So does that affect everybody? Or... Uh, is it a 30 foot radius? 30 foot around the totem, yeah. Diameter or radius? Radius. Then, um, yes. Do you, okay. do you still have it if you go outside of it? No, I don't think so. Then you lose it. Okay. Okay, so yeah, but you two both gain nine hit, hit, temporary hit points. Okay. All right, what are you doing, Peleus? <laughs> you should take off the band. The what? Blindfolds. You should take off their blindfolds. Or call it, yeah. That's a good idea. We'll do that. <laughs> All right. Start taking off blindfolds. You start taking off blindfolds. All right. Um, yeah, you start running <clears throat> to humans. Just a collection of all ages. Like, no one's super small. <laughs> you know, but, um, yeah, you start taking off blindfolds. We'll say you get about six blindfolds off. Okay. Um, yeah, people start looking around like, what is happening? <laughs> all right. Hi. Um, that brings us to Bryn. Use my charisma skills at these humans. Okay. At them. <laughs> <laughs> all right, humans. Are we all here now? So we all know what's happening. All right. We're all on the same page. Yeah, okay. Now that we got this dragon and this rat fighting about the sewer hierarchy <laughs> and, and monarchy, um, I, I think it's a good time that we should uh, go. Um, so over here is, um, uh, if, you, if you can just follow me. Um, if you can see. They're yeah. all chained at the ankle. Yeah. Okay, well, I can, I can grab the person in the front and be like, <laughs> just drag them. Yeah. Yeah. Just be like, okay, over here. If you fo- if I if you know if you just follow me here. Yeah, they all are like chained together, so they're not chained to the floor. But oh, so yeah, yeah, they're changing the line. So I'm yeah. like, okay, we're gonna be in a line here, and we're gonna go because uh, being staying here is not gonna be good. So we're, we're gonna roll persuasion check. Yeah. Come on, man. Oh yes, um, that's a twenty-four. 24? Nice. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you succeed. Um, as um, yeah, one line of humans is like. Okay, okay, as they, as Peleus is like, start taking like blindfolds off, a lot of them are like, oh, all right, where are we going, where are we going? Um, we're, we're, we're heading out, guys. I'm going to be on the front of the line. You're going towards the other set of stairs, going up, or like, where, are you, where are you heading? I'm going to the place where like it goes outside. Okay, right? that, yeah. okay, yeah. yeah. So yeah, they, risk it. they start like yeah, shuffling, it. they start shuffling, moving about like, 10 feet each turn. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay, guys, it's going to be pretty tight, but if we all... Uh, <laughs> we, all we all hurry to get to it. <laughs> and we're all in a single file line, all right? If you just follow me over here, we can get out, all right? Oh my all right. <laughs> all right, there's now a line of humans shuffling. <laughs> <laughs> all right, uh, let's go. All right. Go. <laughs> all right, go, go. That brings us to the Cobalt Dragon. Um. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, rest in peace, the Rat King. I would like... Uh, Everyone to come to my funeral. I think it's going to be really nice. You hear from the top of it to the megaphone, fire! <laughs> As out of the front of it, um, flames come towards you. Cool. Roll a dexterity saving throw for me. Oh my gosh. Well, that's my best one. Uh, 19 plus 6, baby, that is a 25. All right, you take half damage. Oh. Of 76. Oh, gosh. Hey, what? Hey, what? Oh, hey, hey, um, hey, 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 hey. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> hey, um, I gotta go. 
Oh my what? god. We're about to die for you. <laughs> Why did you make this monster? Welcome to level four. Um, level four? I have mm, nine temporary <laughs> points. Hope they count. There they go. Goodbye. Hold on. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm rolling good. Sweet. Oh no. I hate Sweet. that that you say <laughs> You're that. You're gonna kill him. All right. I'm going to die. <laughs> You're not gonna die, Chef. Oh, that was a six. Awesome. I'm going to die. <laughs> You're going to die. You're not gonna die. That was a six. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm <laughs> running out of healing <laughs> slots. <laughs> oh, you're fine. Jeez. Okay. So, oh my gosh. it was 28 reduced to 14 because you made your save. <gasps> okay. So, so that gets um, to the nine. nine. So you're at 23. Nine, uh, hold on, my brain hurts. (laughs) Um, 14 damage, 28, 27. (laughs) (laughs) What's your hit point at now? 23? Yeah, her max is 28. 28. So you should be at 23. What? Okay, wait, so nine, 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 nine minus 28 is 19. 19. So 28 minus 19. What? what? No, it was half damage, half remember? Damage. And she has temporary oh, so hit yeah, points. Oh, sorry, yeah, 14. So, yeah, so it's 14. So Boy. <laughs> so, you took five, uh, so you took five points of damage. Yes. Okay. So you're at 23. All right, 23. Okay, no. everybody. <laughs> Thank Ooh. you. Right, right, right. Good right. work. I'm a film major. I don't do math. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, my gosh. You know, it's like... Dang it! <laughs> As you got, you like um, almost like jumped like above the flames as they came down onto the floor, uh, just like searing basically your, the bottom of your feet. So sweet. Yeah. As uh, you feel the strength from the totem leave you. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. As you, you come back, kind of hard, like shh, a little sense. Like, um, you so didn't like, get me that time. Dang it! Forward, <laughs> march! Oh you see gosh. the machine. <laughs> 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 um. And now it's... Walking towards you, as it's now um, right in front of you. So uh, it's my turn now, and I'm going to go. <laughs> I am going as to As leave. he yells, recharge! And you see the... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> mm-hmm. So, um... All right, yeah, what are you going to do? It's <laughs> a great so question. How, fa- how far <laughs> how fast can I move? Well, I can, like, use my... <laughs> Bonus action to also dash, so I can. I think I can move sixty f- feet in total. So you're engaged in combat right now. Oh, so no. you can, so I can bonus dish- dash and disengage. Disengage, right. move away. Yep. I think that's my plan. So you get thirty feet. Oh God. Okay. Um. And you saw the fire came out in a fifteen foot cone. Oh. Sweet. So <laughs> he could move towards you again. Also, so just so you guys know, <laughs> as you're near to D&D, um, dragons have their fire weapon has a, re- has, has a recharge thing, so I have to roll to see if it recharges. Oh. So it may or may not come back. Well, I still um, would like just like to get as far away <laughs> as I can. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> well, I could hide. I have a hide action. Um, I don't know. Gonna see us so you bonus to, bonus action disengage, humans. and then you could get behind. You could get behind some machinery and try to hide if it's possible. That might be a good op. That might be an option. They would know where you went, but they wouldn't know exactly like where. Those are better odds than I feel like I had before. All right, so. So you're gonna disengage and like run back up the stairs. I think so. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. so you disengage as yeah as light on your feet. You run away. And kind of, you know, you see like the front part of it comes slamming down and bashes and cracks the floor uh, where you were standing. No! Uh, it's like, dragon! <laughs> you can't get away with us, rat king! Today you will rat king your last! <laughs> yeah! Well, All right. you and haven't yeah, got me yet! You run back up the stairs and behind the large machinery you came around. Mm-hmm. Uh, roll to mm-hmm. hide. Is there something I add to that? Uh, stealth. Stealth. Seventeen. Seventeen. All right. You were hidden. I'm. As hidden. they saw where you went, but uh, so yeah. So behind you, there's like 
a wall with a bunch of pipes in it, a uh, lo very large pipe with the slope that's mm -hmm. not that easy to go back up, mm -hmm. but it's there. So. Mm -hmm. Yes. <clears throat> All right, as you go 30 feet away from it. All right. Sweet. Uh, Sweet. All right. Fox, you're up. It's going right. well. Um, I'm going to help move along the humans, like take off more blindfolds. Okay, yeah. Um, we'll say that first line has its, all its blindfolds off. Okay, so. Uh, there's about, working. say, like 27 humans in the line. Oh, okay. Well, then I'll start working. Okay, sounds good. All right, yeah, they're shuffling. Uh -huh. <laughs> Keep on shuffling. Um, okay, we're just going to say they're going to go after Bryn. Because oh. that's, that's when <laughs> okay. he's holding okay. the leaf. So. Yeah, that's fair. Okay. Yeah. They're like now, like just like rounded around the large pipe in the middle of the room <laughs> to get, go towards the exit. Okay. Cool. All right. So that's all you're doing to take out blindfolds? Yeah. Okay. Peleus. There's another uh, line of humans, I guess. Keep doing that. All right. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to provoke the dragon. Yeah. You go to the line of humans. All of them are like, what did you do? <laughs> this is, uh, yeah. Um, I don't. <laughs> I'm not all right. good with words. Bren. <laughs> yeah. I don't speak words good. Bren, what's happening? All right, humans. <laughs> so uh, inspiring. When you when you were kids, did, did did anybody tell you how to forward march? Would you like to inspire them to walk faster? And in formation. And march in formation. <laughs> yeah, march, march, organization. <laughs> roll, a per, roll a performance check. Oh wow. Performance check. Yep. All right. Where's did you go like left, 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 left. All right. Um, I do that. You like oh, start wait, hitting that's your wrong dice. That's yeah. Oh, you, you start have, hitting your weapons. You have a better chance with it. Be <laughs> fine. Yeah. Um, oh, that's great. That's a 22. 22. Hey. As a human, oh. in rhythm with whatever you're doing, <laughs> still in a little, how to march. Start marching fast as their speed doubles. <laughs> All right, yeah. humans, we're, we're going out of here. All right. All right. So, uh, um, yeah, the humans get over to, um, like, where the exit, and there's, like, there's kind of just, like, this thin plank that's going over to, like, the very thin ledge um, of, like, how to get out of here. It's, like... Uh, <laughs> are you sure about this? Do you want to well, die? Yeah, well, it's <laughs> either in there with the dragon or over here. So far and much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. So yeah, they they're beginning to go across the wooden plank. Oh boy. I also have a feather falling. They scroll. roll a natural twenty. <laughs> yeah. yeah! <laughs> as, it's like as you hear the front um, front man say, "We're not dying today." Yeah. <laughs> and they start going across spectacularly. <laughs> so. Uh, Good job, humans. You. You really warm my soul. Right. Let's uh, go up. My brethren. They didn't fall into the sewer. Great. <laughs> it's oh, terrible. Oh, All right. Um, <coughs> that brings us to the dragon. Um, he's like, <laughs> forward march, Ben. <laughs> uh, he's gonna like walk up the stairs and round the corner. You're there. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So uh, it's like recharge. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna see if it recharges. You found me. <laughs> no. Does not recharge. Yeah! <laughs> um, just barely. I have to roll a 5 or a 6 on a d6. So oh, wow. I, I mean, those are fairly good odds. Um, <laughs> and, as you hear it, it's like a large clang, and you hear the engine go, it's like, dang it! <laughs> Smash him! <laughs> and the head comes in to hit you. Oh, so. um, cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What's your AC? We rolled a 19. <laughs> well, it's not that. Plus six. So. Oh. So, uh, definitely not that one. <laughs> All right. Oh, that's... I'm going to die today. <laughs> mm. Oh, okay. That's good. I rolled a one plus yeah. four. So that's... Um... Oh, it does more damage. Sweet. Okay. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> so Sweet. That's, um, so five. So five blundering damage as the front of this furnace hits you square in the chest. Oh, fair uh, enough. And also burns you. <laughs> fair, fair enough. Uh, for three fire damage. So that's, that's not too bad. That's just eight. Eight total. Yeah. So what is twenty three minus eight? Fifteen. Yeah. 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 As yeah, this thing like strikes you in the chest. Like you stumble back. Ooh, <laughs> like your clothes are singed. Oh God. Um, Maybe you should have put down a different totem. Oh well. <laughs> it's only for that. <laughs> All right. Yeah, great distraction, Rat King. Um, good job. Well, there's a good uh, job. Fox, it's yeah, your turn. Okay. Oh, no, sorry. It's Rat King's turn. Rat King's turn. Rat King. So I, um, is there any way that I could, like, you mentioned there are, like, pipes on the ceiling. Yes. Is there any way that I could, like, acrobatically climb on machine? You could try and, and climb like, on the machine that's right next I'm to you. I'm going to try to get up. Get up. All right, get so, up. so you get disengage. Up. A roll an acrobatics check to try and move up this machinery. Come on, baby. 10 plus 6 is 
16. Yeah, so you are able to get on top of this machinery. Look at that. Um, <clears throat> now, the machinery is like level with the dragon, like with the cobalt dragon, we'll say. Cool. Um, so, yeah, as you're now standing on top of it, we'll say you have a little bit more movement. So, like, so this machinery, like, so it's open here, stairs going down, you're now on top. They're like, the machine, there's like pistons going up and down on top of it. So we'll see you like got one of the pistons. You're not going like. That's, that is, that's good. That's, that is good. All right. So yeah. Um, so I'm there now. Oh, you're there now. You're there now. You, uh, that was your action to get up there. Yeah, I'm down. Okay. Uh, Fox. Okay. Um, so one, like. Ten. One line of humans is going. Okay. Well, let's get the other one going. All right. Um. Yeah, the other one starts moving 10 feet at a time. Can I, like, inspire them or something? Uh, roll a perf uh, performance check. Perform as good as me. Probably not. <laughs> 14? 14. Um, yeah, they start moving at uh, 15 feet per second. So okay, well, faster. I'll take it. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, they're about 15 feet behind the other line. Cool. All right, uh, Peleus. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you can't attack the kobolds. <laughs> it's just a mass of kobolds, basically, that make that up. So it would provoke him towards us. What? It's up to you. <laughs> it's up to you, man. Well, I'll follow the humans to the exit. Yeah, are they... Out? One line is almost across. Okay. Into the exit. One line's getting there. Those are good odds. Those are good odds. I mean... Mm. I'm gonna be real. I don't think I can take another fire hit. What do you want to do? <laughs> Time is fleeting. I know, I know. Oh, I guess I'll hit it. <laughs> oh, All right. Here we so go. I'm gonna run around. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we'll say you can be 45. You're almost there. You'd have to <clears throat> dash to get there. We'll say until like hit it, because it's up. Uh, it's up the stairs going after. Right. It. Um, so, but you can see like the back end of it sticking out from behind the machinery. Okay, yeah, I'll do it. <laughs> All right. There he goes. Yeah, so what are you what are you doing to it? So I'll use a quarter staff. So you're not next to it yet. Dumb. <laughs> <laughs> you had to dash to get there. Oh, to do that. <laughs> Does that, can you bonus action dash? I think so. Oh, you can spend a key point to dash, right? Yeah, I, I believe uh, so. So you'd have to spend a key point to bonus action dash so you could use your main action to hit it. Yeah, okay, I'll do that. I would like that very much. <laughs> okay, <laughs> yeah, you go back into the field and get your... Temporary hit points again, so that's good. Yes. Yep. Um, all right, yeah, roll to hit. Sure. Um, 19. 19 hits. Nice. As, um, yeah, you hit a mass of kobolds <laughs> off the machine. Roll uh, for damage. Ha, 11. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah, yeah, right. Some damage on the board. Yeah, as you swing your quarterstaff and you hit kobolds off of the machine. <laughs> um, some of the kobolds fall, um, most of them kind of like scramble back up the walls going up to the ceiling. Nice. Oh. Yeah, cowards as they are. As you hear, get back here! <laughs> <laughs> for, the, for the machine. Um, you did 11 damage? Yes. All right, sweet. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, use your bonus action. Yeah, All right. use my bonus action. Uh, Bryn, your turn. All right, so I'm across the bridge with these this one line of humans. Oh, did you go ahead of them? Yeah, I was ahead of them. Okay, yeah. yeah, yeah it's like you're, leading you're the charge. The yeah. Yeah. Um, so yeah, you're... Yeah. <laughs> you're now like so there's kind of like this like little cavernous part where like the water goes out so you're now because you, you can look out you now see also this ginormous structure you can see um, as you look down you see the boring river and a huge gorge um, flowing uh, flowing south so we're like kind of right over here right like okay. you're in Vineo City we're like right over here right um, so above you is a ginormous bridge uh, oh, so we're like crossing. here. So right here. So you're right below the bridge there. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. All right, humans. Uh, to the right, you can actually see a very narrow path heading along like the cliff face, basically leading, um, leading off uh, to like going, going up the river, basically on the side of the cliff face. So that would be going north. Going north, yeah. Towards, yeah, towards like. The mountains. Yeah. yeah. I um, mean. All right, humans. We're going north towards the mountains. All right, Bryn's wow. leading them. All right, you're out of there. Yeah. Um, the humans, that human train, yeah, is following you. Okay, mm -hmm. the other human train has to roll to get across the rickety wooden plank. Oh, boy. Ooh. I roll a four. Roll again? Um, so, 
I actually looked up your lucky feet. Oh dear. It oh no. It only applies to you and things that your effects are on. Okay. So, it is so not, no. It's okay. not other people. So we've been doing it the wrong bit, but we're doing oh, okay. it right now. So okay. Um, so they cannot roll again as um, two humans in the middle of the plank slip off and fall Gosh, and start you. taking other humans with them. Oh some no. Some holding on, but some people are in the sewage now running fast. Um, Slipping. All right, but well, we'll get back to them. So they're not all in. This is like they're chained together, so they're not all falling in yet. All right, but it's cobalt dragon time. Um, oh boy! <laughs> seeing uh, seeing their prey get away, but they, it's like turn around, <laughs> fight the oppressor, recharge. <laughs> Tries to recharge their breath weapon. Does not recharge. Uh-huh. <laughs> um, but he's gonna try and slam the front of the furnace into your face. Nope. That's cocked. 18, so that hits. It's nice knowing you're right, King. Is it me or him? It's him. Oh. oh. Uh-huh. All right. Well, he's got this temporary hit point. Uh, yeah. He did. <laughs> oh, no. You take 13 um, bludgeoning damage. Oh, boy. As the front of the furnace hits you and six fire damage. So that's 19 damage total. Wow. <laughs> this is boys at 17. 17. Oh, ouchie. Yep. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you very much. And you get like I blasted be, into the chest. I would have been dead if I took that. So um, I appreciate it. I, I rolled. Welcome. I rolled a nine on a d10 and a six on a d6. So. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay. Well, that was bad. All right. Um, uh, Rat King, you're there. Oh boy. You're there. Um, can Roll I? Roll up and down a piston. Can I launch off the piston onto the pipes on the ceiling and be up there? Roll an acrobatics check. <laughs> 18 plus 6 is 24. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> All right. With the strength from the piston, you wait. Bend your legs. Boom, and you get blasted towards the ceiling. Uh, you grab onto some pipes on the top. I'm just like, like on like fours. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm like scuttling away. Can I move 30 feet? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we can say like, you're like hanging, so you can move like 15. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Um, and you start healing squeals like, ah! <laughs> and you like look between the pipes and you see little kobolds like running away from you. <laughs> yeah. All right. It's I'm like, down. I'm, I'm content. <laughs> still in Rat King form. Yeah, I am. It's like, I'm Rat King. Like, Rat King is like, it's like this little right. old man in like a big cloak. <laughs> like a big like wooden, not wooden, a big woolen. I don't know what I'm talking wooden about. Cloak. Oh, man. Big brown be cape it. and his like, All right, uh, Falk, your turn. Okay, we need legs. something about these humans. I'm going to try and pull them back up. All right, roll a strength check to Here we go. pull them back up. Here we go. As you grab onto the end of them. 17. 17. As, yeah, you successfully pull the humans and get the, the remaining two humans, get back to the board, climb back on, and they start moving forward. <gasps> so you saved them. Oh, boy. <laughs> they didn't fall off the cliff. Good job. <laughs> All right. Uh, Paleus. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, man. Um, it's up to you. Don't know if I can't take another hit. <laughs> You, Come on, boy. You have to disengage as an action. Yeah. But you also don't immediately die if you go down, so, you know. There's that. Yeah, I don't know. All right. You gotta decide fast. I know, I know. Um, Run away. Yeah. I did. Scurry up the yeah. pipes. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm going to run away. All right, disengage. <laughs> yeah, disengage. Um, and you run thir- 45 feet away, which is further than the dragon, but still in its fire breath range if it does follow you. Mm. So. Yeah, I, I don't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, Bryn, your turn. So you're, you're, you're just leading the humans out? Yeah. So. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> like, you, like, you're basically gone now. Like, you're not in the chamber anymore. Yeah. Yeah, so. Um, we got the second group of humans through. They're yeah, they're now about to cross, so they'll be behind the first group. Yeah, so okay. I need to find okay. a good place for our, us hum- the humans to like be. So the cliff face goes on for like a while. You're gonna be walking for a while to like get out of here because you have to like it's like up above. You can see like the wall of Vinio um, goes for about like a mile. 
Mm. Oh, so in the path falls it going below and eventually looks like it goes up off of the video. I guess scenarios. I'm leading the humans out then. All right. So we, know any Brain is gone. <laughs> um, the humans following. Uh, it's a cobalt dragon. Ceiling, seeing <laughs> Gideon on the ceiling, it's going to turn around and walk 30 feet towards Peleus. Um, oh, oh boy. It's going to try and recharge its breath weapon. It succeeds. Oh God. <laughs> Um, it make, was nice. Make a dexterity saving throw, Paleus. Oh As my gosh. Right. Gonna die. Fire! Everybody's you are gonna going die. to live. Everybody's going to die. 21. 21 yeah. saves. Half damage. Half damage will be down to what? Like one. Why are you switching your dice? All right. I'm just getting more dice here. Okay. <laughs> That's awful. Hey, it's not. Horrible. Um, what does that mean? <laughs> <There you go. laughs> Not dead. Okay, so that's two, four, six, ten, <laughs> twenty. Reduced to ten, so you take ten points of fire. Okay. Seven points. Those are the seven points, guys. <laughs> Y'all need to get those humans out of here real fast. Um. Yes. Yeah. As the fire, tsh, uh, the very edge of it, <clears throat> you're kind of just like turn away, and your back gets seared. Tsh. Guys. <laughs> guys. Guys. Is it safe to say that I have no idea what's happening inside? Yeah, like I yeah. Mean, you know that like you, you hear commotion and like guys <laughs> you come out from the hole, but you, so you know st- stuff's going down. Help right. pools. Right. Help pools. Right. Right. Rat king. Rat king. Rat king. So I'm just chilling on the ceiling. Um, <laughs> is there any way that I could like um, Use a weapon from on the ceiling. I mean, you have a bow. I have a bow. Yeah. Can I do a cool thing where I hold on to the bars with my feet and then... Make an acrobatics check. You are a rat right now, so... (laughs) No, I'm not. I'm a human. I just control the rats. Make an acrobatics check. 16 plus 6. You make it, so (laughs) you can do it. Yeah, you let go with your hands and bend down from your feet. Yeah. Yeah. Upside down. Cool as hell. Yeah. Even if you're Uh, probably going to die. So... (laughs) Whole image. Or roll a hit. Yeah. Roll a hit. That's 15 plus 5. That hits. Sweet, 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 sweet. So 1d6 plus 4. 4 plus 4 is 8. 8. All right. Not bad. Yeah. Um, yeah, as your arrow hits and some of the cobalt scurry away from it. Um, a few little holes now forming in the like massive cobalt dragon. Coolio. Mm. All right. Um, uh, folks. Yeah. Okay. So like, <laughs> the, all the humans are basically gone around now, yeah, right? Yeah. All the, okay. the humans have made it around the corner, so they're basically okay. I all have of some, them, every group. Yeah, both okay. groups. I have some questions. Okay. Um. Oh lord. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Pass without trace. Okay. How does like? To so, what extent does that work? So, it's a group of people. Right. And like. It increases your stealth roll. Okay. If you're in the open, it doesn't turn you invisible. Okay, that's what I was wondering. It's not invisible. Okay. So. Second question. Okay. Um. If I douse this thing in water, would that be helpful? Because <laughs> it's it's fire. You could try. So, also, Paleo's is gonna die. You can try. Yeah, I'm, I'm close. <laughs> you have say, the healing I'll items. Say, oh, I do. I'm gonna do hold that. on, <laughs> hold yeah. on, buddy. I'll say it'll have an effect. Okay, I'll try to. I'll try and create water. Okay. okay. Um, ten gallons of clean water within a range, and gonna, so it's just gonna fall as rain in a thirty-foot cube. <laughs> okay, on the on the, on the cobalt uh, dragon. Uh, yes. All right, um, it just happens, right? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, uh, above the cobalt dragon, a massive sheet of water forms and starts falling on it, and you can hear it. Tss, 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 it starts um, cooling the dragons. The coal is like, no, recharge faster. And it starts to recharge, and it's harder for them now to recharge the fire breath in the forge. Cool. Very you, cool. You've imposed disadvantage on the fire breath recharging. Yeah. <laughs> um, all right, Paleus. Okay, so I think I will drink that vial of potion I forgot I had. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Keep uh, track for you, buddy. <laughs> yeah, the bigger one or the smaller one? I only have the larger one left. Okay, yeah, so that's, yeah. It, does it say? 44 plus 4. Yep, roll them. 3, 2, 5, 2, 7, 3, 10, 14. So 14, nice. yeah, you heal 14 points of health. So that's 21. 
That is not bad <laughs> at all. Yeah, as you see, that's a bonus action. Yeah. Um, so yeah, Paleus whips out. <laughs> <laughs> I see his chug, like scourge marks chug. heal a little bit. <laughs> all right, and all right. you still have movement. <laughs> yeah. Move farther away. <laughs> okay, yeah, you move further away from it. I you were gonna punch it. <laughs> All right, punch um, it? Bren, you're just going with the humans, so you're gone. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah. It's the cobalt dragon. So I'm um, farther away. <laughs> yeah, you're just gone. Yeah, basically. Um, so you're over there. So, you, so Palis, you can run. Fox is over towards where like the bridge is heading out. Mm -hmm. um, there's another stairs over there, and in the middle is like the pumper, basically. Where do you want to run to? Um, you can go be with Falks, you can go over by the stairs. Probably go over by Falks. Okay. So, you're okay. not dead! <laughs> uh, yeah. Sounds good. So, <laughs> Almost was. that's about 50 feet. So the Cobra Dragon <laughs> starts walking towards you guys 20 feet away. Jeez. It's going to try and recharge. Okay. Um, it fails. So. Cool. But it does, it heats up, and it does evaporate the water that was on it. Okay. It's like, keep it out in the Okay. okay. Um, Rat King. <sighs> I'm just going to take another shot from the ceiling, dude. Go for it. Yeah, just hang out. <laughs> Do I have to roll acrobatics? No, again? you're hanging from your leg still. Woo! <laughs> okay, Sherpa again. Um, oh, God. That's not going to hit. It's a seven. <laughs> seven oh. does not hit. Mm. As um, it bounces <laughs> off one of the mechanical parts of the machine. Zzz. Worth a shot. All right, folks. Okay. The machine is 20 feet away. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm going to move. <laughs> Where are you moving? Um, you can go outside. You can leave. <laughs> or you can move to the other side of the room. I'll just leave. <laughs> I might just leave. <laughs> you, uh, no. I'm freaking loyal. Okay. I'm going to move to the other side of the room. Okay. I would, yeah. I would love to leave as well. <laughs> How do I get out of here? Putting you... You put about... You're 50 feet away from the machine. Okay. The machine's now close to the center of the room, basically. Okay. Um, <clears throat> all right. Paleus. All right. How far away is it? It's um, 20 feet away from you. You're next to the exit. Falks just ran to the other side of the room. Well, to the other side of the room? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so she went but so, to the, the stairs, the other, the other stairs, basically. So between me, is the dragon between me and... Falks? Yeah. No. So the, oh, the okay. dragon's like on one side of the pumper, basically, mm -hmm. on this side. Uh, pumper's here, you're here, Falks is here. Okay. So if I were to use Fist of Unbroken Air, it wouldn't... It wouldn't push it. him towards, yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. You can so do I'm going to do that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Do that. Okay. You have to roll to hit? Um, or does no. it, it saves, right? It's strength saving throw. All right. Which is probably... Good at that. <laughs> yeah, that's um. what, yeah. Uh, what's the save? Oh, I don't know. Is it mine? Or? Yeah. What's your What's your wisdom saving? What's your wisdom score? Wisdom. Yeah. Wisdom score is sixteen plus three. Um. Sixteen. So what's it's plus three? So it fails. Okay. Fails. Yeah, nice. it fails. All right. So it takes um three d ten bludgeoning damage. Yeah. Go for it. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Six. Okay. Six. Okay. Five. Nice. So 17. 17 points of damage. Not bad, not bad. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> and I guess pushes it. I don't, you can't really knock it prone. It's a machine. Um, we can hope. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, it could be knock, um, it's knock prone? Yeah. Is it? On a um, failed save. On a, uh, hold on. Yeah. Yeah, but you. You can't push it or knock it prone. You knock it prone. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so basically, like, the legs, like, kind of fall out from underneath it and onto the ground. Um, so we'll have to use half movement to get back up. All right. Already I did that. <laughs> um, it's, as, yeah, you hit it, a lot more kobolds, like, fly off of it, basically. Like, um, some fall dead to the ground, and more, like, run up the walls and scurry up into the piping. Um, almost half of all the kobolds are gone from the machine. They're hmm. rather large holes. Hmm. Cool. Um, all right, Bryn, you're gone. Uh, <laughs> Cobalt Dragon, she needs half its movement speed to stand up. Um... And then, so it'll have three. Okay, so you stayed where you were, right? Or did you move? Uh, <coughs> I didn't move. So. Okay, <laughs> so um, it's gonna move the remaining fifteen towards you. Oh God! It's gonna try and recharge. It succeeds. Come on, man. 
Roll a dexterity saving throw for me. As it's like, recharge! Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. A 25. That saves. <laughs> Good thing I'm nimble. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's a lot of sixes. Oh, no! And I didn't even roll yet. Uh. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Um, so hmm. that is um, 10, 20, 31. <laughs> Divided uh, in half, so that's 15 damage. Okay, this okay. Man is six. six. So I'm back Ooh. to where I was earlier. <laughs> yeah, yeah, as the fire that potion, comes... You'd be dead. Like, he would be actually dead. Right? Because no, he would be been dead. more than half of I would yes. be dead or dead. As dead. you're unable to move, but you do turn your back again. You're back, and I'm thoroughly scorched. Mm. Um, Y'all. All right. Y'all. Uh, <laughs> folks. My dude. Okay, okay. I so, wish I had that. Talking in the Brand here thing. screaming <laughs> of someone being burned alive <laughs> from the tunnel. Quite a ways back now. <laughs> okay. Pretty far away. So where where is everybody again? Um, so the dragon is next to Peleus, who's next mm -hmm. to the exit. Mm -hmm. You're next to the other set of stairs. Gideon's on the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, that's right. I'm still up here. Gideon's fine. Uh, fine how far I'm away fine. is the dragon from me? Um, thirty feet. Okay, I'm gonna try and use. An, I'm gonna use entangle. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Strength saving throw. All right. It succeeds. Okay, uh, so it's not restrained. As roots come up and try and uh, try and take the dragon's feet. It's like stop it out, and it stomps all the roots out. Okay, well. All right, Paleus. I'm moving away. <laughs> just go. All right. I'm just getting just go. out. Yeah. You go out the tunnel. I, yeah, all right, I'm gonna disengage. die. <laughs> um, and yeah, you're around the bend basically. Yeah. I'm a die. Turn around! <laughs> I'm a die. <laughs> All right. Um, Bren's gone. Total dragon time. <laughs> uh, it's going to move 30 feet up to Falks now. Yeah. And it's going to try and recharge. It fails. So it's going to try and bash your head in. It's like, hit it with a stove! Uh, it hits. Oh. It's okay. I've got 31 hit points. <laughs> Ooh, good. Um, Dang. What does that? <laughs> For who? Uh, that you take uh, 12 points of bludgeoning damage and 5 points of fire damage. Cool. 16 so, damage. 16? Uh, 17. 17? 17 points of damage. As so, yeah, the front of its face tush, hits you. I have 13 left? Yep. All right. Okay. Folks. Mm. Oh, no. Rat King. Rat King. <laughs> so I'm chilling on the ceiling. <laughs> I'm going to take another shot with my bow and if arrow. If you hit, you finally get sneak attack damage on it. So. Oh! Okay, come, <laughs> on, come on, come on, come on. 16 plus 5. That hits. Yeah! Oh! A little sneak attack damage. Oh my god, okay, it's been a while. Okay. That's two more d6s on it. So, 3d6 3d6 damage plus 4. Okay. 6. Nice. Plus mm -hmm. 3. Okay. Plus 3. So 12 plus, plus, plus 4. Plus 4, so 16 points of damage. Nice. It is bloodied. Oh, oh wow. Bloodied. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> yeah, um, it's severely bloodied. Yeah. Um, as yeah, your arrow hits it, striking off multiple kobolds, the arrow piercing through multiple of their skulls, basically. Some kobolds fall to the ground dead, more scurry up into the walls. Um, large holes now in the machine. A lot of petals are now vacant. Mm. Um, all right, Falks, here it's right in front of you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes. Uh, how far am I from the exit? Um, it's now between you and the exit. Oh, that's not cool. Uh, but you're about um, 50 feet from the exit. Um, so I have a plan. We're going to see if this works. Okay, go for Okay, I'm going to use Wild Shape. Okay. Didn't oh, make... yeah, you can do that. <laughs> yeah, I can do that. <laughs> That'd be good to do right now. And uh, I'm going to... Turn into a panther. We're gonna see what happens. If okay, I do this. nice. Yeah, you turn into a panther. So my armor class is twelve, and I get. Is that a? That's an action to do that. Yeah. Okay. And then, thirteen hit points, and my speed is fifty. Okay. So can I use my movement to get out? You can. It'll try and hit you. It... Uh, yeah. All yeah. right. But you know you're still moving. So, um, what's your AC? Right now it is twelve. It hits. <laughs> As it slams, damn, it's thrown its face into you. Um, it's 11. That's 16 points of damage. Okay, so that gets rid of it. Well. How much how life did the panther have? 13. <laughs> 13. So you take three points of damage. Yeah. Um, if you turn back into your normal self as you round it, um, you can still move 30 feet. 
Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you move 30 I'm just going to trust you can get out, get in. You move 30 feet away. Um, all right, um, Peleus, you're gone. Yeah. Bryn, you're gone. Like, you're just leaving, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm gone. Um, Dragon, to turn around, Peace. follow you. Going to try and recharge his breath weapon. Fails. Cool. It's going to try and slam its head into you. What's your AC? Mine? Yes, normal. Uh, normal AC is 15. It hits. Uh, oh, hmm. no. Hmm. So. The druid the can't die. <laughs> I have one left. <laughs> yeah. Uh, mm, yeah, can you roll again? All right. It's, how much weight AC do you have? 15. It hits, I guess, still. Oh, no. <laughs> well. All right. Um, dealing nine, 14 points of damage. Are you down? I'm down. Da, da. As Falks falls unconscious onto the ground. <laughs> uh. Oh, God. Gideon, Rat King, <laughs> what do you do? <laughs> Oh boy, I, w- I want to take another shot of that dragon room. Oh <laughs> All right. Do I still get sneak attack damage? <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Your ally is not it's engaged in combat. It's just Gideon. Mm. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Uh, 12 plus 5 is 17. Uh, that just hits. Oh boy. Oh, and to think Bren was gone the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> Plus four, six. Six, six damage. Mid-up, he was like, so, how was it? <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm on the ground. It's on its last Saving legs. Saving the 60 humans. Come on. Come on. Come on, dude. I'm, uh, I'm on its last legs. All right. Um, so. Brent, can you, can we've you never, tell Brent to get in here? <laughs> okay. So we've never had to roll um, uh, death saving throws here, right? Except. except Alias did once. Yeah, yeah like once. Scarecrows. <laughs> Oh, right. Scarecrows, okay. yeah. Well, and I was the it, only one who could really kill all right. them. Yeah. And also in the pilot the episode where I died actually. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so well, that was the yeah. So just because I know once, I'm as the I'm there's a new way of doing it that I really like. Where I will oh. roll your death saving throws. Oh. And nobody will know if you succeeded or failed or not. Oh, Ooh, I, um, don't like oh, I don't like that. Oh, oh, I love that. For a dramatic purpose, I am in love with so, that. Oh, no. Yeah. So you yeah. will, no yeah. one will know if you have succeeded or failed or not. I love that. All right. That's the first one. Okay. Okay. Do you, do you, you have potions, right? <laughs> Mine's gone. I used it. You don't have multiple? I, I think I, I gave, I thought I gave one to All you right. earlier. The cobalt dragon. I don't have any potions, I don't think. It's going to turn around. I erased like, it. One yeah. more! <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> I just don't know. All right, it's going to Poor brain. Um, walk beneath you. Uh. It's going to try and jump and recharge and blast you with fire at the same time. <laughs> it recharges. <laughs> now it has to see if it can jump and hit you. Does not. It rolls at two. Yeah. <laughs> As it's like jump, it <laughs> falls back onto the ground. Oh, we're blinking. Oh, we're. This is a long episode. Oh, <laughs> it is like a finale. Um. Okay. Let's pause, and we are back. Oh, <laughs> we're nice. back. Ah. Hello. The dragon fails to jump up, or the cobalt dragon fails to jump up to hit you. Mm-hmm. But it does let its fire breath out. Um, above itself, and it's like jump. <laughs> I was like, "You idiots!" <laughs> Reach out. <laughs> um, all right. Um, that brings us to you. Come on, Gideon. Oh, I'm gonna Ooh, take another shot. Come on, come on, come on. Go for it. Please. Make it a good one. I just need a good roll. Fifteen plus five is twenty. That yeah. hits. Come on, man. One d six plus four. Come on. Three plus four is seven. Seven. All right. Ooh, it's getting close. Oh my god, what? No! <laughs> I mean, I don't uh... know. Oh, all right. This is it. Um, Falks. Death saving throw. Okay. I don't know what to believe anymore. <laughs> I am um, hmm, terrified. 
<laughs> You're terrified. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. All right. Does Paleus ever catch up with Bren? That's the real story. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's I'm cut the like, action and get to what's important. Yeah, I mean, Bren, like, I, I want to know what's happening. So I slow. need you to get in yeah. here. You are, like, just shuffling along, like, the edge of this cliff face. Like, your back's to the cliff. Everyone just, like, step over. Step over. <laughs> <laughs> and Paleus, like, you've reached them because you're pretty fast and nimble. Yeah. Like, the humans are chained together, so they're moving, like, inch by inch by inch <laughs> oh. going along so here. So, like, good so, like. So yeah, you two are now together. So you could relay information to Bryn. So what this Please. is all yes. Uh, <laughs> so this is it. You don't know that Falx is down. Yeah. You left before that. So Falx and the Rat King are still back there. <laughs> and, His proper um, title. It's not looking too <laughs> good. I'm hurt King. pretty bad, and mm. uh, this is it's not looking good. So you want me to shut? Are you I'm telling just, me you want me to go back? I don't, I'm just, I don't know. <laughs> I'm telling you what's going on. You hear, like, screams from inside. <laughs> mm. From the ether, I'm like, ah! There is, like, like, there is, like, so each person, it's probably about, like, 30 feet of, well, yeah, it's probably about, like, 30 feet of people, like, on Thanks. the cliff face. You'd have to try and, because you're in the front. I think, <laughs> like, I think it'd be too dangerous to bring them back at this point. I don't know. But I don't know. <laughs> we'll leave it up to. Some of them still blindfolded. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Maybe it's um, better that way. Um, Some of them crying, like, oh, I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Just keep walking. Thank you, man. I don't know. <laughs> like, here's the thing uh, it's going to be really hard to get out of this. This It's going to be really hard for me to get back because I'm not as nimble as you are. Mm-hmm. But I don't know what. I can. All right. Yeah. You're having this discussion. Um, yes, cobalt, this is cobalt dragon. <laughs> um, recharge! Please, <laughs> gonna say try say. And please do not. Recharges. Oh my god, dude. I'm going to die. Okay, um, I'm going to die. Oh my god. I don't want it. It's going to try. I want jump. it to hit her. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to try and jump up. It succeeds. <gasps> Oh my god! This is so Okay, bad because it's so close, so roll a dexterity saving throw, Gideon. Bad. If you succeed, you won't take any damage. So, um, uh, uh, so an eight. An eight. Mm-hmm. Does not succeed. Oh no! no. <laughs> How many points do you have left? Fifteen. Fifteen. All right. You will take half damage. Oh that's so, um... It's tr- like jumping up and barely hitting you, basically. Hey, hey I need you to <laughs> chill. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm like sick. I feel sick. Oh. Hmm. Doesn't sound too good. I mean, it's not great. Hmm. So it deals 25 damage, reduced by half to 12. I have three points. You have three hit points. Come on. So I have three hit points, three and hit I'm points holding left. on tight. Hold on, your hit points. As you hold on tight, the flames <laughs> shear your back. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my. So if you go like behind the pipes, like up above, it can't hit you. I thought that. Wait, I thought that was an option the whole time. <laughs> if you would have moved. I thought it was. I was hanging. Okay. If you're behind the pipes, can he hit them then? Okay. So, I mean, no, you'd have to be, like, outside the pipes to, like, hit it, basically. Okay, cool. Okay, so guys, if you hide back there, you're pretty much just leaving Falk dead. Yeah, I'll because t- I'm the only one who's doing damage right now, yeah. so yeah. I gotta keep going. <laughs> so close. Oh my gosh. Is it my turn now? It's your turn now. Okay, come on. Oh, I... <laughs> Don't fuck this up for me. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, oh, short bow time. I kind of want somebody to die. 18 plus 5. That hits. Oh. Roll for damage. 1 plus 4. 6 plus 4 is 10. That's going to kill Come you. on. As your arrow flies, ah! <laughs> you hear, reach up. <laughs> and the arrow goes through the head of the kobold, hoping. <laughs> <laughs> and you hear the dragon. And all the kobolds, now the king, scatter. And the machine falls to the ground. Oh 
Oh, boy. And had 10 hit points left. Oh! 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 Oh my gosh. Wow. I still might hey, die. I can't, yeah, she, is his... she still might be dead. <laughs> yeah. Julie's still dead. But at least I did something very cool. That was really, <laughs> really cool. Go back Can I take his turn. crown? I want it really bad. Yeah, um, roll an acrobatics check to make your way down. Nine plus six is 15. All right, you may, you don't fall and take five damage as you go down. Good. So, yeah. You, <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> I did it! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Um, so you are now down on the ground. Yay! Um, I. Well, first things first. Um, f- f- Fox <laughs> good, dude. <laughs> you go over to Fox? Yeah. I don't have any. I don't have any. <laughs> you can just mourn. All right. So you have a medicine kit. Uh, I have these tools. <laughs> so you can try to roll a mess and check on her. If you fail, you cause a death. Uh, you cause her to... What? Uh, yeah. I don't want to risk that one. Does or she, you can you... wait and see if she succeeds her death saving throws. Does she'll stabilize. Does she have any health potions on her that I can use on her? I'm looking. Roll an investigation check. 14. All right. Do you? Um... Have any... Do you have a medicine kit on you? No. <laughs> what? Any medicinal herbs? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, because I've always been able All to right. heal myself. So I give can, you my broom. <laughs> you can try and help, or you can see if she stabilizes on her own. As you go over to her, you place your hand on her chest, and her, her heart is still beating. Cool. Cool. Um, what is my medicine modifier? Yeah, Zero. What? Don't. <laughs> You'd have to roll. Oh, my gosh. You do whatever um, you want. Who would I have to roll? Uh, You're not proficient in it. You have to roll one. a 15 or above. Oh, God, no, I'm not going to take that one. I'm going to let fate decide. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All mm. right. <laughs> um, you wait. <laughs> this is so dramatic. This is awful. I hate this. This is great finale right here. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. And as you sit back down, you watch folks. Um, or your heart's still on your chest. You can hear it beating. And suddenly you hear a come out from her lips. Hey, as huh? She, as she stabilizes. Oh, okay. I was like, oh, I was geez. like, huh? As you succeeded three and only oh failed gosh. one. That is awful. That is That's absolutely awful. awful. That's but terrible. it's great. It's drama. so great drama. <laughs> okay, now that that, now that, I think I had an actual heart attack. <laughs> now that that's all good, I want to look for the crown of the guy. I want it. So, yeah, so I want it so it'll bad. take you an hour king. for you to become conscious. That's okay. So, <laughs> but you're alive. I'm alive. Sounds good. I'm the only one looting. Yes. All for me. We are separated. All right. I did nothing. <laughs> you did nothing. You let the I, humans away. This guy did like some damage, but I did all of yeah. the damage to this guy. We would have had two dead, <laughs> two unconscious. Oh That's true. wow. That's true. All right. Uh, roll an investigation check. Need, much I just want the crown. Me, to be honest. Yeah. Well, ah! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of needed you. Yeah. I did, uh, I just w- I want it so bad, but I, mean, I rolled a four. I mean, <laughs> I mean the crown's out in the open. I want. I'm, I'm, <laughs> so, I'm taking the crown where and I'm is it? putting you it on my head. You find the crown, and the crown actually has an arrow going straight through it. That's, uh, that's kind of sick. That's kind of sick. <laughs> Does it still fit on your head? Um, I mean, it's like small because oh. cobalts are small, oh. so it's almost like like a neck choker. Basically. Oh, <laughs> wait, that's, so, that's cool. I want that. I'm, that that is a part of my character now. That yeah. I'm wearing the crown of the kobold king on my neck as a choker. You, you might, you might want to wash it first. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. There's definitely some brain material on the inside mm. of the crown. Mm-hmm. Just the aesthetic. Um, I'm, so I rolled a four for anything else. That's that's what you find. Cool, I'm, I'm good with that. All right, so I leave the cave. No, wait, you're still there. <laughs> you can take me with you. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I'm I said strength. that and I was like, mm. Mm. Uh, I, I'm gonna go find the other guys. You're just gonna leave me here? All right. Well, uh, well uh, hmm, a good point. I um, fixed your bagpipes that one time. <laughs> That is true. <laughs> um, I'll play you a nice tune on my bagpipe. <laughs> Roll for forest check. <laughs> uh, 12 
plus seven is a 19. Okay. <laughs> I'm whispering the bagpipes. A slow, mournful song. Her recovery rate increases. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. As in the void of and like water you're laying in right now in your mind, you hear the graceful sound of bagpipes. Gideon. <laughs> Gideon. Calling you back. Gideon. Gideon. Is that you? Yes, it's All right. I knew that favor would come ahead. <laughs> so, um, Gideon waiting next to Falks, Bryn and Paleus leading the group of humans on the cliff out of Vineo. That is where we will leave off. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. And <laughs> close oh, the 2019 oh Lights, gosh. Camera, Roll season. Thank you all for joining us. If you've made it this far, Ooh. bless you. We <laughs> for for an episode, hours. right? <laughs> um, Next like year, we're going to be on Christmas break until January. Um, and Jerry, when we come back, big news, we're going to come back as only a podcast. So, so this is the last time you will get to see our beautiful faces react to the shenanigans <laughs> and all of whatever just happened. <laughs> oh, wow. um, this is the last time you'll see the same jacket I've worn every week. So <laughs> We will give you updates, True. though. Like, we will let yeah. you know. Yes. We'll still we'll wear you the same jacket every We will time. still be posting on YouTube, mm-hmm. just an audio file. Maybe with yeah. a small video in there of just introducing us to see how we look when we're not on a video. The, <laughs> Hello. the jacket will be there. The jacket, <laughs> I promise I'll wear this. Come for D&D, stay for the jacket. Um, as always, I hope everyone has a great Christmas. <laughs> Or whatever you celebrate, please have an awesome night with your family. As always, we love having you. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.